Oh, hello, my friend. Come on in. So I'm super stoked because tonight it's finally raining outside and it's nice and cold. Um, and I love it. That's my favorite time of year is, is when it's cold and when it's raining. So um, what better way to bring that in than to just do like a nice hot chocolate with a little mm to it. So we're going to do a little spiked up hot chocolate. Um, and I think we're going to call this the chocolate blankie because it makes you all warm on the inside. So it's the chocolate blanket. All right. So super easy to make. The first thing I did actually was steamed up some milk. Um, so we got some steamed milk, a nice little froth right there on the top that we're going to use. And uh, right now we're going to mix up in our shaker. We're going to start with a little bit of chocolate sauce. Okay. Um, I'm going to do one, two counts of the squeeze in there. And of course this is going to depend on how chocolatey you want it, right? Um, so you can do whatever you want to do with that. Um, we're going to use a rum that's uh, kind of a molassesy rum. In this case, we're using Diplomatico. Um, I really like this rum, and so that's what we're playing with today. And we're going to go an ounce and a half of that. You want to taste the taste the liquor, uh, but we don't want it to be overwhelming. We do still want it to be um, a hot chocolate. And that's what we're doing. So, ounce and a half of that, and then we're gonna go and use a Godiva chocolate liqueur in there. And this, we're gonna do one and a half ounces as well. There we go. And while we have those two, that's all that we're putting in there for the uh, the liquor, the booze, okay? Um, but we have that syrup in there. So while that's in there, we're gonna go ahead and just give it a little to make sure that syrup kind of dissolves into it as best we can. Yeah. Okay. And then before we pour anything in, we're going to do a little drizzle on the inside of our glass. Make sure if you are doing this, you're using a tempered glass like this. Um, you don't want to use a regular glass because the hot steam milk will crack it. So you want something that's a tempered glass. All right, there's that. Then with that, oh, we're just gonna pour this right on in. Yum, there we go. Ounce and a half, ounce and a half. So it's about three ounces of fluid in there, okay? This was four ounces of milk when I put it on the, uh, started steaming it, okay? So all I'm doing is just scooping the foam out first. We're gonna lay that in right on top. That acts as a little filter actually when you're drinking, kind of filters through it, tastes good. And it gives us a little bed to put sprinkles on or garnish on. And this we're just gonna pour down the side so it doesn't disturb the foam on the top. There we go, okay. That's four ounces of milk. And that's it for there. Oh, let me go grab my chocolate. I'll be right back. I'm using a dark chocolate and you want the dark chocolate to be frozen so it grates better. So we're just gonna grate that right over the top. Yeah. Just like that. And then we're gonna take a little chocolate pocky stick and put that right up on the top there. That way you could stir it all in if you want to. And that's it. Chocolate blanket. Yummy. Enjoy. Cheers. Snuggle up.